Redskins fired defensive coordinator. The Washington Redskins have changed course defensively. Coach Jay Gruden fired defensive coordinator Joe Barry and his top assistants on Thursday, as well as strength coach Mike Clark. The team confirmed that Barry, Clark, secondary coach Perry Faywell and defensive line coach Rob Key will not be retained. For two seasons, Barry presided over a unit that was short on talent but also failed to make meaningful plays for most of the season, and finished last in the NFL in third down conversions allowed many of them eight key junctures. Gruden and other team officials could not to be reached for immediate comment. Last week, Gruden seemed to publicly weigh how much blame to assign to Barry as opposed to a unit that lacked NFL caliber talent and depth. It's tough when you don't have the same 11 in there all the time, Gruden said then. There are things we obviously have to get better at. Third down conversions and red zone, obviously, are issues. Two-minute drills at the end of the half. But I like the way the guys compete, and they play hard. That's very, very important. Teams are going to make their plays, but I feel like we're getting them in the right spots and giving them an opportunity to make plays. The job doesn't come with a completely bare cupboard, as cornerback Josh Norman and outside linebacker Ryan Kerrigan both remain under contract. The handling of Norman was one of the biggest strikes against Barry this season, and led to a head-scratching press conference in which Barry attempted to explain that he couldn't have Norman cover the opponent's best receiver because it would be too confusing for the rest of the defense. It's easy for the guy that's moving. It's hard for the other, three or four DBs to get lined up, Barry said. It's easy for you to get lined up but the other guys, it's difficult and that's why most of the time. People get talked out of it, especially with offenses that move their top receiver around. The next week, Norman was shadowing the other team's top receiver. Speculation on Barry's replacement will center around a handful of big names. The biggest is likely to be former Denver defensive coordinator Wade Phillips, who interviewed for the Redskins job two years ago but was passed over. Phillips' son West is the Redskins' tight ends coach. Cincinnati Bengals defensive coordinator Paul Gunther could also be in the running. Gruden is familiar with Gunther from time the two spent together on the Bengals staff. The coaching turnover may not end with the defense. Offensive coordinator Sean McPhee will be interviewing for head coaching positions in San Francisco and Los Angeles this weekend.